Hey, welcome back. Van here. Today I've got a video on a knife sharpener. This is going to be straight out of the box. A uh, good friend of mine, Jason Williams, I actually won this on a giveaway he had on his channel. And I'll leave a link to his channel in the description box down below. But this is it right here. It's a 4-in-1 knife and tool sharpener. So we're going to do an out-of-the-box review on this. So if you're new to my channel, my channel is all about saving you time and money with my how-tos and reviews. And there's nothing better than getting a good product and sharing it with somebody that you know. And we're going to try this out. So my knife that I've got today is, is this one right here. It's my everyday carry. It's a birthday gift. It's not sharp. It's really not sharp. I've been meaning to sharpen this thing for quite some time. Well, let's read what we got back here on the back. It says instructions. <laughs> Maybe you can see that. Stop it if you need to. Pause it. Hopefully it's not blurry. All right. Okay, so I stopped and read the instructions. The instructions uh, for sharpening knives to use, rest the sharpener on a flat surface, insert the knife into the V-notch course at 90 degree angle with light pressure, draw the knife through the notch several times in this manner may be required for your knife's cutting edge to conform to the proper angle, ugh, angle of the AccuSharp. Once the angle is achieved, then two or three light passes should be sufficient to bring your knife's edge back up. Uh, remember, light pressure is sufficient. Heavy pressure may cause you to lose control and uh, cause injury. Repeat this process through the V notch marked fine. Again, two or three passes should be sufficient to hone and polish your edge to a smooth, sharp finish. Okay, so you want to lay, you got your coarse and fine, right here, coarse and fine. Put it down at a 90 degree angle pull back. Wow. Try this thing out. <laughs> Had it off camera. Pretty good. This product also has this product also has a diamond file. Uh, it's called a diamond sharpener, but in yeah, my line of work, we call this a diamond file. And you can take, I'm not gonna do it to my knife, but say you got a ax or something you wanna sharpen, you can take and run it across there like that. Like that. Anyways, and then it's also got this diamond uh, file right here for a serrated edge. You can run your, if you had a serrated edge, you can run your serrades down that edge right there. That's really nice. Working with metal like I do uh, at my job, not, this is really, really nice. This is like top of the line diamond coated stuff here. 
Uh, I see a, a mark right here in it. You, can you see the gouge in there? Uh, didn't say anything about it in the instructions, but I know what this is. It's for a fish hook. You can take your fish hook and stick it inside that little slot right there and run your fish hook down it and it'll uh, sharpen up your fish hook. This is really, really nice. You, If you need to, you can take this cover right here off and flip those tungsten blades over and have, uh, if it ever starts to wear down, you can flip those over to where you got two fresh sides against each other again and it'll be like new. Uh, Gets your ceramic rods in here. Those things will never wear out. They might break, but they'll never wear out. So this is the AccuSharp. Uh, seems to be a really, really nice product. It's got a place you can put a lanyard in it. So there you have it. This is uh, the AccuSharp. Uh, like I said earlier, you got the, the cores to find. You could take this plate right here off and switch your tungsten carbide uh, blades around and sharpen up your if they get dull uh, you've also got here you've got your diamond uh, honer right here and it's got the let me set better now it's got the slot right here for you to put your uh, fish hooks in plus it's got this one right here that you can sharpen your your flat blades with if you got an axe or something that you need to sharpen like that locks in pretty good it's not flimsy it's nice it's really nice so accu sharp i'm not sure where where jason picked this up at but you can go into the link down in the description box down below and you can find a link to it on amazon you go to amazon and pick it up if you use that link, it'll help me out to support my channel. Uh, thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed the video. I hope the video is informative. I hope this is something that you might want and maybe it helped you out if you was thinking about buying a sharpener and you wasn't sure if this was going to be the right thing for you. Maybe this right here helped you out and help you decide. So, y'all have a good one. Thanks for watching and you come back now.